So, and, and I just want to make sure that, you know, even like a lot of this brown staining and everything, if you go in with your thinning shears, you can take off a lot of that stuff. And um, it, it, because the thinning shears leave everything looking very natural, it won't look like it's all been scissored off, but you can just kind of um, play with it. I mean, she, you saw how stained her face was before. So I've just been, been kind of, uh, especially on the chin, you can kind of come in at an angle and take out some of those stained hairs. And I do, that, I do that also with like my Westies, if they have that staining. If you pull the lip back, um, especially on a lot of your, your Westies and stuff where that flu area is really dark brown, if you pull that lip back, you can take your clipper, especially like your Brevera or your Mini Arco, and just clean out, actually clip out that area. And then all of a sudden the face looks really white again and all that staining is gone and you can't see that it's been clipped because all the other hair falls over it. Yeah, if you, if you just, right on the lip line, see, see the staining right here? Sometimes it's like a lot darker. So you can come in and right in that flu area, just take your clipper and skim right along the lip line. And when the hair is down, you can't see. You can't tell that it's been clipped, but it gets rid of that really dark brown. So between that and your, and your, and your thinning shears, you can kind of get a lot of the brown stuff out. All right, Sue, we're going to move on. Okay, so just had to come see you. Okay, bye. Thank you.